Today we will see how to write a script for a solar orbit. Before we start coding for a solar orbit, what are the requirements of a solar orbit? Do we require a sprite called Toby? No, we don't require a sprite Toby. So what we have to do with the Toby? We need to delete sprite Toby. So basically what are the requirements for the solar orbit? We require a background and require two sprites. Which are those? One is sun, one is earth. So what earth will do? Earth will move around the sun. So we go to the PictoBlock interface and we'll first thing what we do is we will delete our sprite Toby. Then what we do? Then we have to select a background. The first thing we require is a background. So I say choose a background at the bottom. Can you see over here? Choose a background. Click on it. Search for a background. I want a star background or a space background. Look if I have. Yes, I have a star background. Then what I require? I require a sprite. First one is sun or second one is earth. So choose a sprite. Click on it. Type in a search sun. Yes. Click on it. Then I want one more sprite. Say choose a sprite and say earth. Yes. Okay, by default, the size of both the sprites are 100. Can you see? Sun, click on sun, it is 100. Earth, also 100. So I will make earth slightly smaller. Okay, I will make it to 70. Okay, and I press enter. So I will make, so I made earth slightly smaller. And sun, I kept it 100. Now, I need to start coding. So first select the sprite which you want to code. We have two sprites at the bottom. Can you see? Sun and Earth. So click on Sun. Okay. The moment you click on Sun, go to Event. Okay. And say when green flag is clicked. Why green flag is clicked? So that we can execute our program. Then go to Motions. And I say X and Y axis 0. Okay. I say X x is 0, y x is also 0. Run the program and see if the earth is, sun is coming in the center. Yes, sun came in the center. I used only two codes, green flag to execute the program, x and y axis 0 because I want sun to be in the center of the stage. Finished with the coding for sun. Now we start coding for the earth. So click on sprite earth. Okay. But now we have done coding for sun. Click for earth sprite. Okay. Now we need to start coding for earth. First thing again we require is green flag. Again I am saying green flag is used to execute a program. Now we don't have a clean slate. Why we don't have a clean slate after green flag? Because we are not drawing anything. We are not drawing anything. We are just rotating the earth around the sun. Earth will be moving around the sun. Okay. Now, I say, go to motions and I say, x and y axis, 0. I will bring it in the center. I will bring the earth in the center. And I say, point in 90 direction. Okay. I will run the program and see. Yes, my earth also came in the center of the stage now what i have to do i need to create a block okay go to my blocks and i make a block earth okay i give a name earth and i say okay now what i have to do now it should turn the earth needs to turn one degree okay while it's moving it should turn one degree so i say turn one degree and i say Go to x, y axis, 0. Let it be in the center. Okay. Let it start from the center of the stage. Let the earth start from the center of the stage. Then I say, move. How many steps? I want to move from the center. How many steps? I say, 150 steps. Okay. I say, 150 steps. And then, again give a degree. Turn, 1 degree. 
okay and then call my block auth close the script and run the program and see whether it is working whether the earth is moving around the sun yes earth is moving around the sun understood students so kindly practice this course we have two sprites okay for sun we have done coding and earth also we have done coding okay so kindly go through these steps and practice thank you students